Hi everyone, Dennis Foley from Acoustic Fields. Today we're going to talk about sound absorption versus noise transmission. There's a lot of confusion out there about these two principles and they don't solve each other. I mean, you can't use one, you can't use sound absorption to solve a noise transmission problem, which is mainly the confusion that I see, and you can't use noise transmission to solve a sound absorption problem. So, what is sound absorption? Well, we know it's a process of energy conversion. So, we get friction with the materials we use, and then we, we get heat as a result of the friction. We have an energy transformation, and that's attenuation. Noise transmission, though, is all about vibration. So let's use kind of a, an analogy here about a glass of water. With sound absorption, we have so much water in the glass. And through sound absorption, we can lower that. We can drop in sponges, so to speak, sound absorption technology into the room and lower the amount of energy in the room, attenuation. Noise transmission is different. If we have a certain level of noise that's coming into the room, okay, and leaving the room, the only way we can affect the amount is to deal with the structure. So a little bit different twist in the treatment side, but a completely different application of technology. So. Here in our glass of water, we're dropping in sound absorption technology to lower the water level. In noise transmission, we got to get a different glass, basically. We got to get a glass that's thicker, okay? So disregard the, the water level in the glass right now as a noise level. So the bottom line here is we have to deal with the containment vessel or the structure versus dropping things inside the containment vessel or structure. So the goal with absorption is to reduce the amount of energy in the room. The goal with noise transmission is not to let it in the room at all or not to let it out of the room by dealing with structure. So completely different approaches. So sound absorption, noise transmission, completely different situations that you have to Realize, one, you deal with inside the room, and two, you deal with the structure itself. Hope that helps. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video, and if you liked it, please give us a thumbs up. We also have a newsletter that you can subscribe to, so please do that because we offer special price discounts to only those on our newsletter. And then don't forget about our forum. We have started a forum on our own website where people ask questions and I usually get a chance every couple days to look at it. There's an interchange between people on the forum and we'll give you real answers uh, on a regular basis so that'll help you. Thank you.